radio station. It yes. could be. It is in Napa Valley. But my whole life goal has been to get higher profile than them, so I appear first on Google. Kayvon's going to get residual <laughs> checks. I know it. That station's going to start paying you residual they checks. They need to, for sure. But I love your station. You were In college, I was broke, and I, you guys were hitting golf balls off the roof of a building back when that was legal. <laughs> and the person who caught the one that said U2 got two free tickets, and I, I saw my favorite band in the world. So. You mean it's not legal now? In the name that? of love. Oh, God. They ban all the fun stuff. <laughs> You've been on Last Comic Standing. You've been on Disaster Date on MTV. Nice shirt, by the way. Wearing Thank the you. old school MTV shirt. Yeah, I'm wearing old school MTV because I'm from the 90s. Y'all don't recognize. You weren't from the 90s. You didn't know. We used to have Giga Pets, slap bracelets, baggy jeans. You know what I'm talking about. I do know and, what you're talking about. And we had about. music videos on MTV. Yeah. If you liked the song the DJ was playing, you had to put your cassette in and wait for it and hope he didn't talk and hit record. And then you would come in early, like, welcome. And now I've actually <laughs> cussed out the DJ yeah. for talking over the song. And now look at me. Yeah. Like, I am what I despise. You are that guy. <laughs> but yeah, because you're, you're trying to make that song for your mixtape when your girl was in the car. You're going to be making out. And you just want us like slow jams. You know, now you're losing 96.5. You're like, dude, I'm going to kill that guy. People don't do mixtapes anymore. They do Netflix. Yeah. But you're on Netflix. Net I'm on Netflix. So if you want to Netflix and chill by yourself, I'm your guy, baby. How many people do you think chill with you on Netflix, if you know what I mean? <laughs> just, just, do you think about that ever? Oh my goodness. Well, you gotta think awesome. about that. Well, you know what? But you don't know who it is. Could be some guy going, I chilled to him on Netflix. He was great. <laughs> he has big biceps. <laughs> but uh, yeah, and if you guys can find me, Reno, if you can find me on Tinder, you get a free ticket. Uh oh. Yeah. You gotta swipe right. You gotta Especially swipe. the cute ones, right? That's right. So in Reno, you just gotta swipe right the just whole time. Just swipe right anyway? Just swipe the whole time you're here. <laughs> All right, you're gonna be the Carson Nugget, by the way, on, well, tomorrow. Tomorrow, my Carson Nugget. The rest of the time, Reno Tahoe Comedy Club. I'm not gonna tell you the times. It's at night. Google it. And you know what? If you're on Facebook, hit me up. Uh, if you heard this interview, you on Facebook, cave on. KVON, then I'm gonna give I'm giving away five free tickets. You gotta be the first five people because you gotta support Alice. Like they supported me to see you two in San Jose. Say, God, you're full of memories, aren't you? <laughs> this station brings so many memories to you, doesn't I, it? I love Alice. So Power much. radio. Yeah, man. It's fantastic. This is, and it's good to be in here and being interviewed. I never thought this would be my life, but coming from Reno, Nevada, you go to LA. And I tell you what, if you're from Reno, the better you do in LA, you come home, they always support you. That's why it's the best place. Like even if you get an audition for a TV show, they throw you a parade when you get back to Reno. They're like, you didn't get it, but that was awesome. Is that why Virginia Street's closed? Because of you? Yeah, usually. Because you're the parade. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's closed like, Virginia Street. I just failed an audition yeah. for Hulu. I'm back. <laughs> a lot of jokes. I got 45 minutes of new jokes. I make fun of new myself. Oh, so good. If you get offended easy, please don't come. Ladies, self-deprecating humor is the best kind of humor. It's the best. It's yes. The best. I make fun of myself. I make fun of my dad, who's Middle Eastern, but lived in Reno. Not a lot of Middle Eastern, so ladies, if you see a white guy come up to you talking Persian, that's me. Like, hi, how are you? What you are doing? I'm Kayvon. Once you go Persian, there's no other version. Yeah. <laughs> can I use that? Yeah, go for it. Yeah, you can pretend you're Persian. If you the radio station you can still Kayvon from you. You have to wear a V-neck down to your crotch, and you have to wear a big gold chain. People think you're from San Jose and you're Persian. Looks like I'm Borat. <laughs> yeah, Borat. You gotta wear that speedo. <laughs> yeah, that would be hilarious. The mankini. <laughs> I have. Wore, I wore a speedo. All, I was on the um, the Reno Aquatic Club swim team, and I wore a speedo. And I will never forget. I was only like six, and I dove in the water, and I forgot to tie it, and it went down to my knees. But the coach said, no matter what, if your equipment fails, keep swimming. He meant goggles. <laughs> <laughs> I was in my speedo, and I didn't realize until I was doing backstroke. They're like, stop, stop. I was just kind of a little guy waving in the wind. I've grown since then. If you remember Good. me from that day, I'm 20 years older now, so come on by and check my, check out my new stuff. Tell us where you're going to be again this weekend. Check Reno, Tahoe stuff. Comedy Club. Look for me on Facebook. You listen to this station, I'm giving away five free tickets. That's how we roll. K-V-O-N, that's me. Fantastic. Thanks for coming in.